Welcome back, which is my name is Amel, and we continue with House of Ashes. Not much to talk, I just got some water because I've been drinking coffee all morning. <laughs> Let's continue. Iraq, 2003. Jason Kolchek, confident and tolerant. Colonel, good trip. Eric King, rational, insecure. Not particularly. Welcome to Camp Slayer. You're early. Apologize. Apologies for arriving early, Lieutenant. Things are moving fast. I hear you, Colonel. Glad to have you on board. Techs are ready for your presentation. As soon as we get word from the CEO, we're good to go. You should read this. Wasn't this guy man of Medan? Then you hear? There's a new king in the castle. Looks that way. Clarice! Clarice! <laughs> oh my god! Clarice is in the game! If you uh, if you didn't know this, uh, on my old channel I started in, uh, Inside Joke where I call every mannequin, every female mannequin, I meet a Clarice and she's supposedly my wife that died and haunts me and, you know, all that chisel. <laughs> There's a Clarice in this game. I love it. Let's continue. Uh, this, this is my... My assistant, Clarice Stokes. Doctor Clarice Stokes. Cold check. First lieutenant. Cold check. Wow. The briefing room? Oh, I shipped them already. Not Clarice. Clarice doesn't go with anyone. <laughs> oh! I see. What's up, Marine? Can't you keep up? Rachel King, commanding abrasive. Also known as Maddie and Charpe. Nick K, defensive and romantic. This could be our last time together, Rachel. How do you know After that? After what happened at the checkpoint, uh, I thought I was done. These last few weeks, you've, you've lifted me up. I don't know where I'd be without you. Rachel King? Colonel King has arrived on base, ma'am. He's en route to the briefing room. I'll be there in five. Fuck, it's him. He's early. Your husband, you mean? Don't you think it's about time you came clean? What? Put your clothes back on. Straighten up. Excuse me. Hey, Rachel. Are you gonna tell him about us or what? You and Eric have been apart for a year. Whatever you had, it, it's gotta be over. Come on. You should tell him. Maybe I just don't think this is the right time. That's bullshit. There's never a right time. Fair enough. Soon, Nick. I promise. Soon. Wow. D did not expect this to be this way, but... See you at the briefing. Yes. Shit. Marines. Why was that so significant? You'll have to excuse the noise and disorder. We're just getting the base set up. Hmm. Close my mind. Only a few weeks ago, Saddam was living it up in here. <laughs> down down in candy bars while some poor bastard clipped his toenail. Nice image. Uh, if only you could see the state of this place now. Makes me smile. 
We got the CIA, we got the Army, the Marines, DIA, the Air Force. Hey, everyone's invited. Clarice, get on all the way. God bless America. Indeed. I see you, old man. Keep busting out those reps. Hey, you come join me. Maybe I'll teach you a thing or two. <laughs> Later. We have company. Yeah. This year would like to watch me get my sweat on. You wanna spot me, little lady? I can see you just fine from here, thanks. Ignore Corporal Merwin, he likes social skills. Uh, I guess every unit has its resident jackass. Sergeant K. This is Lieutenant Colonel Kane. Just taking him down to the briefing room. Yeah, gotta go get prepped. I'll see you in there, Marine. So what's his malfunction? Nick ain't been himself lately. We got caught up in a shooting a few weeks back. Civilian ate a bullet. Nick took it hard. Is he combat ready? He's a big boy, sir. He's ready. I like PETA over here. What's his name again? I'll Man, just call him PETA. You, behind a desk? you want me to make a call? Nah, I'm all good. People who sit behind desks don't tend to catch so many bullets, you know? So this must be uh, the one and only satellite guy. The one and only satellite guy. I'm Eric King. Lieutenant Colonel Eric King. Give the colonel full sight access. Sir. I'm telling you, when the queen bitch finds out about this, she's gonna flip her shit. Rachel and I, we know each other. She'll understand all's fair in love and war. Sir? The queen bitch you're referring to is his wife. <laughs> nice work, Hotshot. Clarice is not that bad. But shut up, Clarice. <laughs> sure. I'm so sorry. Rachel never said she was married. We've been working apart this last year. So, she's the queen bitch now. She's gone up in the world. If it helps, we like to think of it as a term of endearment. God, why is Let's get you shut up. wearing the sunglasses inside? I'll leave the techie stuff to you. And I'll leave the heavy lifting to you. All right, let me look at deal, this. Lady. What is this place anyway? Looks like an old ballroom. I want to read. That's exactly what it is. I guess the damn like to get down on the dance floor. I think it's dance partner stepped on his foot. It'd be an instant off with her head. <laughs> well, it wouldn't surprise me. Uh, when we're done, I'll let you spin me around a little. Clarice? Don't step on my foot. Clarice, shut the fuck up. I'm trying to read a note. Alright. Survey code. Uh, for, what? You asshole! <laughs> Clarice! <laughs> you can pause and read it, but I didn't, so. <laughs> Colonel King. Queen bitch, hello. Mrs. King. Eric, this is my team. And if you want to brief them, you clear it with me first. I should have warned you I was moving the briefing forward. That's on me. But things escalated, I had to move fast. I have a duty to my team to stay ahead of the curve. I understand, Rachel, but CENTCOM has given their orders. Orders? I'm now commanding officer. I didn't mean for you to find out like this. 
truly. I'm sorry, Rach. Somehow I doubt that very much. This is from Stock Central. It confirms that Lieutenant Colonel King has assumed control of this operation. I'm gonna need access to your network. I'll patch you through. Name? Dr. Stokes. You can call me Clarice. Dr. Stokes, please prepare the presentation. You found something? The loading is a little weird, but maybe just because it came out five minutes ago. What the fuck is that? Modern art or something? This is footage from the highly classified Kalis program. That's supposed to mean something to me. It's a thermal satellite system that I personally pioneered. Oh, well, I'm impressed. Please, pioneer away. You behave like this in all your briefings, Corporal? Boys are just eager to catch a break, sir. No harm meant. Very well. Satellite sweeps of the war zone have uncovered what appears to be an underground storage facility. This will, of course, require further investigation, but I strongly suspect it's where Saddam's chemical weapons are hidden. We got you, you son of a bitch. CENTCOM has given the green light to raid the facility and seize any weapons on site. Hostilities may be over, but there are holdout groups of Republican Guard all over the country. They could deploy those weapons at any time, so we need to move fast. The Army is giving us a ride out there in their helos. On arrival, Lieutenant Kolchak will lead the raid on the facility. Once it's secured, we'll carry out a full weapons inspection. Now listen up. There's been a change of leadership, but Rachel's operational expertise and local knowledge is just as valuable as ever. She'll be flying with us, and I want you all to show her the same respect. Any questions? What oh, the fuck we waiting for? I'm ready. That's tribal territory out there, Colonel. Make no mistake. Those people are feral. I take it we're getting their support? Nah. Too many birds could bring them down on us. We move fast in, fast out. Yeah, that's pretty much what your mama said to me. Hey, careful, boy. If I didn't pull out so fast, it could have been your papi. <laughs> All right, that's enough, Merwin. Sir, what's your call? Uh, I'll request air support. I'll put in a request for air support to be on standby. Rational. Our birds can fly low under the radar. The site is in the Zagros Mountains, so we'll have plenty of ground cover. We go dark until weapons are secured. If we don't break radio sounds within 24 hours, CENTCOM will mount a rescue operation. A lot of shit can go down in 24 hours. I'll quit being a bitch. I'm just saying, that's all. This is why we went to war. This is what gets us out of bed every morning. Make no mistake, ladies and gentlemen, this is how we stop Saddam from using these weapons. Be ready in one hour. Dismissed. Clarice, help me set up the equipment. I'm on it. I don't know, man. This don't feel right. I'm getting this tingle down the back of my neck. Oh, sweetie, look. Almost as if he's been in one of these games before. Rub down, we'll sort that right out, huh? I'm serious. I got a real bad feeling about this. That's what you get from spending too much time with Eric. Is there anything you can do? I'm gonna download the latest satellite data. You can have some alone time with him. Thank you, Clarice. Eric, we need to talk. There's something I have to tell you. You should know. It wasn't my decision to take over your operation. She doesn't miss him though, so. This oh, is it. everything I've worked on these past years, it's ready. This is the big break we've been waiting for. This isn't about us, Eric. 
I just want things to go back to the way they were. How we left it, things weren't so great between us. We've been through worse. A lot worse. <sighs> Nothing has changed, Eric. You know that. You and I, there is no you and I. It's over. Please, Rach, don't say that. Rachel told Eric that their marriage was over. Eric agreed to bring clothes. Okay. Wedding ring. Hey, be careful with that. Oh, shit. Sorry. But you got in that box of tricks anyway. What the fuck is that? Ultraviolet light. We use it to sweep for explosives. Let me have a go. No. How much longer for that download, Clarice? I need it ASAP. It's five minutes ASAP enough for you? Downloading data now. Good. I'll check the satellite maps. Not the greatest bandwidth. We work with what we have. Can you sign this 1348? Huh? Equipment release form. Can you? Oh, sure. Check all equipment, then check it again. Yeah, I hear you. Speak to the team, inspect the briefing room. I mean, technically, you are not wearing it on your finger either, so. What is this? Okay. Is this what I think it is? WP, sir. White phosphorus? It's just for popping smoke. That's all. These are only to be used for cover. Understood? Understood. After Smoke. all, Saddam is the one who's breaking weapons conventions. Not us. Smoke could prove useful at some point. Inspect this. Okay. Let me hurry up before it d decides to just continue again. <laughs> Alright. I have no good... Okay, I can kind of guess where we are. Alright. Joey. You think we'll bag Chemical Ali at this facility? If he's in the vicinity, we'll get him. <laughs> that almost makes it worth the risk. Almost. Well, you know, I'd still rather be sitting behind the desk. If shit hits the fan, at least we can rely on air support to dig us out. I'm sure it won't come down to that. You seem confident. You seem surprised. I'm not gonna lie, he kinda hot. Alright, what is this? Confidential. <laughs> uh, mailman, subject, bandit. Uh, okay, report disappearance to aid worker, Serena. Uh huh, named, uh, was in Marine, uh, failed to make contact two weeks ago. Aids is presumed robbed and killed. Hmm, they have been killed, all right, but not by that what you mean it is. Oh, this is what I couldn't read before. The uh, objectives, blah, blah, organize and direct intelligent capabilities. Apply intelligence expertise to discover, capture and exploit information, organize and direct war. Okay, okay. A lot of military talk that I don't understand. But I'm sure someone that has experience will approve of this. What the hell do we need this crap for? We need to be mobile. We need to be prepared. The facility is underground, possibly under construction. It's safer this way. You want me to feel safe? You give me some more shooters. So, you're my technician. 
secret about you? I should fucking hope so. I'm here to keep our gear in check. And if any Iraqis pop their heads up, I'll take them clean fucking off. You seem pretty confident, Corporal. If you need any assistance with the climbing gear, I'm here to help. Sure, I'll manage, Colonel. Climbing gear. Fucking pencil pusher. Probably shouldn't say that when you're still in the vicinity, but all right. What else? Hang on, my nose. With the survey group becoming op operational today, it is impressive, to, imperative to stress the need for mission success. Our military operations need a clear and compelling end state. Yes, forces have been engaged to the end of threat to the international community from Ira uh, Iraqi whatever. Uh, until we prove that threat, we cannot rightly justify that the invasion under international law. With the... Oh, Jesus. Our allies... Okay, we look forward to your report, Simon Fuller. Alright. We need to... We need to, We need to succeed, or we're all dead. Basically. <laughs> Wait, so do we... Do we check everything? Is this everything? Downloads complete. Let's get to the helos. Let's get dead. What? What? You want to ask me something? I can tell by that look on your face. What do you think I am? I take it you're talking about the skipper? He's a nice guy. Around here, nice don't cut it. What do you think of Ben? Like he's got something else on his mind? Like you. <laughs> oh, I don't know how this is gonna turn out. Salim. Badra Mandali. Salim Off. Othman, stubborn and courageous. Oh, do we play someone from the other military too now? Oh. Zane, and a gate. Zane. When Zane inspect, what does it say? Can't read that. Happy birthday, Zane. My boy has become a man. Koei Zoe. Oh. Oh no! Something horrible gonna happen. Something horrible gonna happen. Oh, it's one of the pictures. Oh, that's uh, something that doesn't look right. Oh no, those aren't the pictures. Oh, there's more house. Alright. Jesus. We are... Wow. We are very close. Oh, very claustrophobic. Jesus Christ. Is there any pictures I can find? On the walls? Maybe. Alright, let's go. Zin? Maybe it's just outside or something. You don't know that. Zane, Tammy. Oh, is he stealing? Ah, but... Oh, I didn't look at the. Hello. Uh, hello, Anna Salim. Salim. Salim Garkun. Abu Zain. Abraham. Yeah. I forgot. Who was Zain? Ma. Ma. Who was Zain? My abnik. ايوه طارق هما مع بعض
لا لا كله تمام اصل كان عيد ميلاده وانا جبت له هديه هديه كويسه اه لما يرجع ابعته لي حالا ما اقدرش اقول امتى هيجوا انت عارف الولاد اي وقت ابعته لي لو سمحت I didn't look at the... Oh. Captain Basri, Ahlan. I'm going to get out of here. You're going to get out of here. You're going to get out of here. You're going to get out of here. The people? The people? The people of the war are over. We're going to get out of here. This is a matter of fact. No one's going to get out of here. The people are going to get out of here. And we're going to get out of here. شايفين هم؟ مطلوب تأكيد يلا شوف جايين علينا بقول لك احنا محتاجين كل راجل في مكانه لاحسن طايرتهم توصل عندنا تمام يا فندم I really hope you are. خلاص يا دار. دي آخر مهمة. It's John. So yeah, I think this is it for this episode. I'm sorry. I just oh, I'm real. I'm annoyed and I missed whatever that was on the table. I hope it was not a picture or something like that. Anyway, this is getting really interesting. I just noticed all the characters that, that are re recurring. Uh, Joey is is, is Daniel. Uh, I, ju I just realized that Clarice is... Um, what was the other girl? Tanya, you know, from Little Hope. Uh, John was just a commander dude here. So, they're just like... This is so nice. I love this. Anyway... Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to like and subscribe to let me know. Join the coven. Become a witch today. It is optional, but fucking magical. And I'll see you in the next video. Cheerio.